Hi there. In this video, we will see an overview of the simulated production order within financials for Office 365 and the purpose of this document within the production order process. As its name implies, it is a simulation and its main purpose is for quoting and costing. Such as when a research and development department or team wants to get a cost estimate on a proposed item. A simulated production order serves as an example of a production order. It does not influence the planning of orders. In regards to the master planning schedule, MPS, and the material requirements planning, MRP, neither considers nor is affected by the simulation production orders. Also, a simulated production order cannot be used as a template because it disappears when you change your status. It, however, can be used to configure a production bill of materials and have that recorded in the end result, a finished production order. As you can see in the general fast tab of this simulated production order, a production order can be made from a type of source, item, family, and sales order. When using item, an inventory item will be produced by this production order. When using family, a production family will be produced. When using sales order, this production order corresponds to a sales order and the production will be done for that sales order only. After determining the source type and quantity, entering the due date supplies the desired date for when the production material is due to be available for use. To populate the lines table, we now refresh the production order. This calculates and updates production orders. If your warehouse location is set to require pick or put away processing, then you can create warehouse requests to put away output. Using filters, you can have the ability to refresh multiple production orders at once. For example, if you wanted to calculate and update all released production orders, you would enter released in the status filter and leave the number filter empty. The production order bomb is generated from the item production bomb calculation. The program copies the production routing into the production header from the item routing. Within the posting fast tab, all associated posting groups are included to assign whip and dimensional tagging to the correct entries. From here in the lines ribbon, we can view the parent items availability by event, period, and location. We can also view the items bill and materials routing and item tracing, item tracking, if we are using serial and lot number tracking. If you have any questions while using Financials for Office 365, you can click on the question mark for a Windows specific help page. If you want help with a field, click on the caption. Or for a column, Click on the heading and select help, like so. And that is the simulated production order.